आर यू ऑल्सो टायर्ड ऑफ रिवाइजिंग योर चैप्टर्स अगेन एंड अगेन एंड स्टिल एंड अप स्पेंडिंग द सेम अमाउंट ऑफ टाइम विच यू इनिशियली इन्वेस्टेड वाई लर्निंग दैट चैप्टर वॉट इफ आई टेल यू दे इज अ वे टू कट डाउन दिस रिविजन टाइम टू जस्ट मेयरली फ्यू मिनट्स एंड दिस कुड बी अचीव बाय मेकिंग योर ओन शॉर्ट नोट्स एंड इन दिस वीडियो we are going to learn how you can make your own short notes and use them to effectively revise your content in the last moment to ace your exams <clears throat> hey everyone this is zaid mumtaz a second year mba student at igms patna and before starting let us understand why do we need short notes and when i am using the term need it means it is a necessity in today's time and let us understand why it is a necessity see the entire concept of preparing for a competitive exam is based on the fact that you have to constantly concise your notes concise your content so that you can revise them multiple times before your exam think it yourself when you attended your lectures initially which were roughly around 14 to 16 hours per chapter you made your own handwritten notes because you knew revising your own notes will take only 3 to 4 hours of your time which is far less than attending those lectures again and again but now with all time high competition increased chapter load and less time and also knowing the fact that all the content in your notes is not going to come in your exam you need to shift to a smarter more concise personalized appealing approach to revise your content effectively and this can be achieved by using short notes so what all content should our short notes include it should contain all the basic theory again in short all the important cases all the formula and all the mistakes which you have committed in solving your mcqs pyqs and tests and for physics and chemistry it should also contain all the graphs all the diagrams and specifically for physics it should contain all the points to ponder which are really important in physics and make sure your notes also include the previous year question topics mentioned along with the year and at last but not the least our short notes should be colorful attractive and readable at the same time because by seeing these two pictures we all agree that we want to see megan fox in color and not black and white now let's come on to the process of making short notes initially i used to make my short notes in this notebook like pattern then i gradually shifted to this a4 sized pattern why you may ask because This has a psychological advantage over those bulky notes. Simply put, that reduced number of pages is perceived by brain as an easy task. Step two: Now divide your page into these three columns, or simply get the template printed from the link in the description. Step three: Now take all the content which you want to mention in your short notes, which may include your textbook, your NCERT, your notes. and all the mistakes which you have committed in your test or your questions while solving mcqs or pyqs you have to take them together and move on to the fourth step now start reading your own notes and while you are reading your notes read the same topic from your ncert as well and precisely and concisely purify your notes your content and start writing it in a flow chart manner or bulletin points in your short notes while you will be writing down your short notes in this column like manner you will encounter some of the topics which you found difficult to comprehend while solving your questions so at that time whichever trick you figured out to solve that question or any important point related to that question you have to mention them here itself in your short note After you have written all those points from your notes and from your NCERT now start writing those points which you have learnt yourself from this chapter by solving all the questions like assertion reason questions or MCQs or previous year questions or somebody has told you something new about this chapter you have to start mentioning those points now after you have completed mentioning all the points mentioned in your notes in a concise way finally it's time to integrate our previous year questions of neat into our short notes 
and as far as the resources are concerned you can check out any content providing website of any premier institute and you will be able to find all the previous year questions there few links are mentioned in the description you can check them out now solve the previous year questions of the chapter concerned and find out the topics from which these questions are asked in your exam and for uh, fun i have you made uh, this trending section over here in my short notes to actually make it interesting in reading you have to mention at least 5 to 6 years of previous year questions which have come in your exam and this can only be done when you put a deep analysis on these previous year questions you have to identify the topics from which the question were asked in that year and you have to mention the year and below that you have to mention all the topics from which those question were asked in the same year from this particular chapter now coming to the final part which is decoration see the diagrams the flow charts the figures and all the important formula are the key points of our short note so wherever you find any diagram just color them up because it usually makes them attractive again and they are the important component of your short notes and any formula you encounter just box them up in a colorful manner or with any other pen which you have just see the difference in these two formats you will find the difference and the importance why it is important to actually color your short note So finally ending with a tip and a warning the tip is always add a blank page in the ending of your short notes because whenever you are going to revise this chapter you are going to find some of the new points which you will want to mention in your short notes and you don't want that you have to again unstaple this beautiful piece of yours and again staple it so before stapling add a page in the end of your short notes and the warning is never use anybody else's short note make your own because they are very personalized and the mistakes which somebody else has committed you can't rely on that you have to make your own mistakes you have to learn from them and add them to your short notes and your content is different from others and so that you cannot revise them so you have to make your own short notes never use somebody else's short notes you can take inspiration from them but don't use them so this was it guys for this video and to my loyal audience who have watched this far we have mentioned some of the short notes and provided the link of those in the description you have to just click on the link and it will download in your device and you can take inspiration and some ideas from my short notes and actually make your own so start making your own short notes as the time is very less and you have to start revising your content again and again multiple times catch you next time with all new content and till then you can binge watch all the content on this beautiful youtube channel we have surpassed 10000 milestone of subscribers and there are a lot of lectures and content available on this channel you can check them out thanks for watching catch you next time